My name is Ornella Satu. I'm a black bomber in the national team. I'm fighting at 75 kg and I'm very happy to represent my country for the Olympic qualifiers in Senegal. So there was a time in my life I needed to find an outlet because doing a PhD is very, very hard. It's a lot of mental pressure, mental stress, a lot of mental involvement and I needed something, an outlet. Right? I needed some type of outlet to be able to enjoy life a little bit. And um, I talked to my mom, my mother was an, was an athlete, my father also was an athlete. My father did judo and my mother was a runner. So when I talked to my mother, she told me, ah, you should try boxing because your dad did judo. Maybe you have your father's gene somewhere in there. You're going to be able to um, be, feel, feel familiar with something. So I tried boxing and well, I started with kickboxing first. And then I had th three fights with kickboxing, but then there was nobody else to fight because I'm, I'm mostly a heavyweight in the, in the women division. So my coach said, okay, let's do boxing because boxing is more established for women for the heavier woman. So I, I started it and then he told me, oh, you're not that bad. So I started fighting, started fighting and then here we are. First, I'm African first. I'm black first. And um, Ghana has a great, great history for boxers. And I wanted to be, I'm trying to be the first woman to be part of that great pedigree of boxers um, for, in Ghana. So yeah, I'm qualified. Uh, technically, I'm qualified to represent two countries. Congo doesn't recognize dual citizenship. Ghana recognizes dual citizenship and the US represents dual citizenship. So like I said, because I'm African first, I'm gonna, I, will, I will choose Ghana over representing Ghana first because I'm, like I said, I'm, I'm Ghanaian. I lived in Congo and I don't know, I know my, my Congolese culture, I know my, my Congolese roots, but I don't know much about my Ghanaian background. So I think that's an, also a great opportunity for me to do something for my country and embrace my Ghanaian heritage. I'm ready to, to at least make it to the top I'm ready to make it in the top three, the top two. Because I know for Africa, they're only taking the top two. And I'm very confident I make it to the top two. Yes, I think my preparation, I studied my preparation in the US. So with the technical and the, the first part of preparation and I'm, fi I'm finishing my training camp in Ghana with um, Coach Asari, Coach Akai, Coach Akpe. The team that we took is, the, is very much of the same team we took in Morocco that we're taking in um, in Senegal. And I think uh, I'm very more hopeful. I think we learned from what we did in Sen in Morocco. We're going to see some of the same boxers in Senegal. And I think because we learned from a mistake and we adjusted our training, we should we should uh, we should be more hopeful than Morocco.